Well, hello and welcome. Todd Prophet here on Turkey Creek. I think this is an amazing property. Austin, my business partner, uh, found this deal and I just wanted to walk you through. <laughs> I just think this is one of the coolest properties. First of all, it has this wonderful creek running through it, which is very, very rare on almost five acres, uh, which is just going to be amazing. You can't really see it through all of the snow and mud at this time, but this is a spring property flip. You can hear the creek in the background. There's a bunch of passageways across, little bridges, little walkways up there on the hill in the rocks and the surrounding boulders. There's the back deck which over, uh, which faces right over the creek, which is the master bedroom, master bath on the main level. You also have a large two-car garage and an upstairs master which has another deck but faces west. So two really beautiful potential masters. And then of course you have all the surrounding landscape, split rail, you have your stone pillars which need to be revised and updated. Now the reason why this is such a great deal uh, is for two reasons I think. Number one, it has major functional obsolescence. This is your um, addition. This was built in a couple of additions. The old farmhouse here uh, which has low ceilings and a lot of issues. And then you have an addition done, done beautifully for its time, just very dated now. Now, going back around here, I want to show you a couple things. I want to get you a feel for the lot, first of all, which, as you can see, is large. You have good access right off the road. This is a great access right off 285, which brings you quickly and easily right into Denver. For those Denver commuters that want to live in a more rural environment, but yet close in proximity, you can see it has a nice field that's gated and fenced for horses, whether you be equestrian or, or llamas or whatever it is your, <laughs> your thing is. And then back here, this is all snowed in obviously, but you see a nice large deck here, um, you know, and a beautiful creek. You even have a swing over here on this side and then you have storage over here on this side. You have a couple of bridges that need to be updated, renovated. But this is an amazing area with the pinions. An unbelievable location right on the creek. Does need some electrical work. As you can see, it's been cut. We don't even have a panel. This up here is where you have your master bedroom on the upper level. So it has beautiful views to the west. Now let me get you inside. So... With the purchase price uh, being where it is that Austin's negotiated, I need about 135 to 145,000 for renovations for numerous things. First of all, we need to pop the top in three different areas to make this functionally useful here. So the great room uh, off to our left, we'd open all of this up, open this up to the kitchen, okay? Walking through the entry, right now it's very bizarre in how it's laid out. The great room is great. I mean, this thing is huge. Beautiful glue lamb beams, popcorn ceilings that need to be obviously um, renovated, taken down, retextured, repainted. But this is a beautiful room. Go ahead and redo the mantle with the dry stack. We'd update the hardware, some of the lighting. Our wet bar here would be updated with modern cabinetry, modern pendant lights. And then going back here, this would all be vaulted and blown out so that it's functional there to the entry. That's the entry over there. So we'd blow that out and make this all open concept type design so that you walk in the home, you're immediately uh, have a sense of openness and you're in the center of the home and it's a social type area or a gathering area, if you will. Right now it's real chopped up. So this all has to go. That would be opened up. This would be vaulted all the way back. Uh, we take out these walls here. All this would be taken out. And then you have a really low ceiling here. It comes down to almost five feet. This is all where we pop the top here. You pop the top and back there for the master. We pop the top here for a living room and then a dining room that's very functional, plus it'd be on the creek, so it'd be very appealing. You know, you can sit and eat dinner or lunch or breakfast or whatever, or, 
or entertain right on the creek. Very, very appealing. And then back here, pop the top on this master. This is the master bedroom on the main level. You have the deck that you walk out onto, which is right over the creek. Okay, all these walls get blown out. And you'd put in just a master, you know, bathroom, walk-in closet combo in here. Right now it's real chopped up and, you know, not functional. <laughs> now, this is the shower and toilet. I don't think you can see in there. We'd have to re revise some of the plumbing. This all gets blown out. You can see some of the farmhouse uh, just kind of reconfigured in, in wild ways. Uh, not, not working uh, <laughs> essentially for a functional floor plan. So all these vaulted again, pop the, pop the lid partially, and then take out this wall, put in a structural beam, and have this, like I said, living room, dining room on the creek open concept with your kitchen back there and then blow this out frame in a bedroom bathroom on this main level for an extra bedroom bathroom on the main level this all gets blown out opened up and then you have a bedroom bathroom back here towards this side or what you could call a den or a lock off or a mother-in-law type of an apartment okay so that's for the main level that's what i would do all of the radiators, all of the heating systems, we would punch out. So we would redo everything essentially. Here's your old, some of your old systems. As you can see, very outdated, not really all that functional. Going into the garage area, this would all be taped, textured, finished off for a home. Uh, and this price point, you know, $650,000 home, nice access off the back, accessing the creek in the rear of the home. But I believe this would be a great deal once renovated for anyone. It's almost 4,800 square feet, and I think it would easily sell for $650,000. And we're looking at about a 150K remodel, maybe less. Shoot for 135, 125, 135 and maybe come in there uh, around that number. Now going upstairs, all paint, carpet, going through here, but functional, accessible, nice bedrooms, good size, great light, great light in these bedrooms. Just need to take off the popcorn ceiling, nice closets, just paint, carpet, hardware, refurb the doors. Here's the common bath on the Upper level here, new cabinets, new countertops. Take out the wallpaper, new surround, new tub, new toilet. And that would be uh, revised and updated, very appealing. And then the final bedroom before the master, we need to replace a couple windows, broken window there, a window that has a leak there with the humidity. Nice walk-in closet though. Plenty of space, plenty of light. And then the master is beautiful, has a nice, fireplace which we do with dry stack stone we refurbish the deck update the decking but nice and large very appealing right off the creek you just look right over the creek here so you fall asleep with the sounds of the creek absolutely beautiful all the windows in good shape just need to be refurbished and then back here we'd put in a tub right below the windows here so we'd plumb for a tub here and then back there, we'd put in a walk-in shower, and then of course, update the toilet, the surround, the tile, etc. So that'd be the shower. This would be the tub, the soap tub. Refurb or take out all these cap the cabinetry here, put in a dual his, hers sink, new fixtures, and then going back here, the walk-in closet, very functional. Large and functional, good access to the roof. So that's it, I hope you've enjoyed this tour. This is another great deal brought to you by